happens. Sean Murray next to ride. He lives about 15 minutes from this site, and at 24 years old, he's a former world champion, and he is the defending national champion. Sean Murray starts up with the toe side 540. Coming back in here, heel side. Sean's gonna go huge, yes sir! A blind judge, a rally to blind. Sean Murray could take Darren Shapiro down here today. Ooh, a little bit sketchy on that huge Chrome 540, but he lands it, and there's Ut Whirly Bird. He is attacking the wake, and now over the kicker, so utilizing two of the three obstacles on course, and another trick afterwards as the boat starts to turn. Look at this Scarecrow Mobius 540. Look at that board rotate. Oh, Sean Murray stuck that. And now here's another angle from the boat. Notice how his eyes are always looking to spot that landing behind that big wake of the air nautique. Sean Murray should have some of the best intensity scores of the day. Great first run. Here comes pass two. Oh, man, look at that. Oh, it's at 313. A rally with a 360 added in for good measure. And now the third obstacle of the day over the big ramp. Looked like he was going for a double grab right there. Spotted the Ford Ranger on the way over. Now he's got to get something in here. Time is running out for Sean Murray as he comes back in. He just throws an indie tantrum. He threw some big tricks, but I don't know if it's big enough to overtake Darren Shapiro. He's going to have to throw something huge on the double up. There's a 313. That's a rally with the complete 360. And now, over the big ramp. Boo! Just a nice poke with the grab there at the end. See if he does get the double grab. Yes, he does. Grab on the way up, and another grab on the way down. Sweet. 74 points would give him the lead in this competition. Here comes the double up. John's gonna have to go huge right here. I'd like to see some big rotational tricks. Oh! oh! Loses the handle. What happened there? Oh, man, that was sweet. And then the handle just popped right out. Good style, huge pop. Grabs the fin of his board and then says, hello, everybody. No handle coming down. We'll see how Sean Murray felt about this. He's dockside with Tony. This season, you've been taking some time off. And what has that done for, like, your contest ability or your savvy? I've taken a lot of time off this year. I haven't gone to all the contests. Uh, just because that, that's not what wakeboarding is to me, is competing all the time. I like to compete, but that's just not it. So I, I took a lot of time off just riding at home, riding for fun, not riding when I don't feel like it. And I just wanted to go out and put together a good run after uh, I just learned some new tricks this week. And, and we'll see even more at the Worlds here coming up.